Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. In this week's misconception in astronomy, we are going to talk about our moon and find out if there is gravity on the moon. So is there gravity on the moon? Well, the quick answer, of course, is yes, because every single object with mass in the universe has gravity. It is a universal property of everything in the universe. So an individual person has gravity. An individual on any object in space, whether large or small, has gravity. So it's sometimes a misconception that there is no gravity on the moon. But the difference is, is that the strength of the gravitational strength depends on the mass. So therefore, the moon will have less gravity than Earth because it has a smaller mass, just as you or I would have a smaller gravity than the moon because we are even smaller. But any object with mass, we can calculate the gravitational force between that and any other object. So Earth has stronger gravity than our moon, but the gravity is still present. Now let's take a look at this as an example and let's watch a video from the Apollo 15 mission, where they did the experiment to see how things fall. So what we're going to see is that while objects still fall, they do fall at a slower rate. So let's take a look at that video here. Well, in my left hand, I have a, a feather. In my right hand, a hammer. And I guess one of the reasons uh, we got here today was because of a gentleman named Galileo a long time ago, who made a rather significant discovery about falling objects in gravity fields. And we thought that uh, where would be a better place to confirm his uh, findings than on the moon. And uh, so we thought we'd try it here for you. Uh, the feather happens to be appropriately a falcon feather for our falcon. And I'll uh, drop the two of them here and hopefully they'll hit the ground at the same time. How about that? So what you saw there is not only did the two hit at the same time, which is telling us about how objects accelerate within gravitational fields and that any two objects will hit the ground at the same time in the absence of other forces such as air resistance. But you should also have noticed that they fell a lot slower at a much slower rate than they would here on Earth. And that's because the gravity on the moon is about one sixth of that on Earth. Now, what's the difference? What would have happened if there were no gravity on the moon? Well, then the astronaut dropping these objects, such as the hammer, it would just hang there in space. It would have there would be nothing pulling it down and it would just hang in space. So, for example, we can show a picture here. And here is the physicist Stephen Hawking in a zero gravity environment, which is something we can also simulate here on Earth. So you would just float there in space. If you were up on the International Space Station, you would be essentially in a zero gravity or a microgravity environment. And if you drop something, if you left something, just let go of something, it would just sit there. So that would be the difference. The other difference would be, for example, if an astronaut were to jump off the moon, if there were no gravity, they would simply fly off into space. Now you'll see that, that they can jump up but they'll come back down again. They can jump much higher because of the lower gravity on the moon. But it does not mean that there is no gravity, just a lesser gravity. In fact, about one sixth the amount that we have here on Earth. So let's go ahead and finish up and summarize what we've looked at. And what we've talked about is that the moon has gravity just like every other object with mass in the entire universe. We know that the strength of the gravity does depend on the mass of the object and that objects will fall at different rates, but will always fall if dropped. They will just fall at faster or slower depending on the mass of the object on which you are dropping that um, that hammer, for example. So that concludes this week's misconception in astronomy about there being no gravity on the moon. We'll be back again next week for another misconception in astronomy. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.